You know, most people, when they hear of trench warfare, they think of World War I and wars fought a long time ago. This is what a scorched earth policy actually looks like. I've got this to you, but I'm safely under heavy attack. All assault infantry are turned down. We need additional artillery support. Over. Support the fire. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. With the 10th of October here, we proudly commemorate the 10-hour war. 10 years ago, for 10 hours, our finest fought to pacify the region in an event that turned the tide of our success in the sandstone region. On the forefront of AI technology, even back then, we are proud to commemorate the event with our security and also our cybernetic infantry forces controlled by our AI mainframe. We are about to switch over to the parade view and on a closing note, we especially want to thank all our security officers who back then took part in the campaign and also our employees of the German, Swiss and Austrian descent who formed our backbone in enduring times. May the vulture shine bright upon your endeavors. Now, our parade correspondent will take over. I wish you a delightful commemoration. We will see today four and a half thousand military personnel marching in honor of celebration of the day. The armed forces and other divisions, the border guards, are also taking part in this year's parade, always performing their duty. Also joining the celebration are delegations from partnering countries. Among the honorable guests, leaders and representatives of the defense agencies of Austria and Germany. Actually, the interesting thing is that hundreds of people were also attending the rehearsals of the Grand Parade. It certainly shows the growth of patriotism. The people in the center are awaiting the start of the parade, and here is the orchestra, the military orchestra, also being ready. Now you can hear the command to bring the battle flags for the military divisions. This means that the parade is right about to start. The soldiers are answering unison. You can see that all of the soldiers are shouting glory. Those people are defending the peace, the territorial integrity, the sovereignty of our country, these young faces. But despite being young, they are powerful and strong, and this is the new army. We have gone through an incredible test of the war and the economic crisis. Our enemies tried to divide our nation and dismember the country. We became stronger and more confident.
become inevitably a part of a single European space. This strengthens our political independence. The EU trade agreement went into force. A clear European strategy has enabled us to compensate for the huge losses that we suffered Once again, dear competitors, dear guests in the capital, dear viewers, our congratulations. Let your name be holy forever. And what I would like to emphasize, we'll not forget. And we will never forget.